In your own words, could you just describe what does chirp mean to you? Well, for me, a chirp was like a renewing of my faith, a kind of a recharging of the battery. Um, that's why I, I got into it. I, I went to the session last year. So that's it provided me an opportunity to do that. Great. And um, how did you get involved with CHIRP? How did you hear about it? Well, well I heard, I, how did I get involved with CHIRP? I heard about it uh, at Mass for, um, uh, early on. And during the year, I had been uh, kind of doing some soul searching about uh, uh, my question to myself was, um, I'd like to have the faith that I had as a child. How can I get that? Or life was so much simpler during those times. And that was, I was experiencing that at the same time that the uh, CHIRP announcement came out, things like that. So I thought I would try it. What did you get out of CHIRP? Well, I, I think I got a lot out of CHIRP. I mean, I think that it uh, gave me an opportunity to uh, uh, share my thoughts uh, about religion, my relationship with God, and I also saw... Uh, other men who were uh, having a uh, personal relationship with God, and they shared that as well. And then, of course, we had the uh, the witnessing of uh, s several members of previous chirps, and they, they shared with us uh, very deep experiences that they've had in their life. And uh, so it kind of gave us a, an, an opportunity to, to share, to get to know one another, camaraderie, but also then to know that there's a group of men who uh, share the same values and uh, um, backgrounds for life that I have, and I, I feel that um, we'll continue to be close in the years to come. Okay. Um, what, if anything, has surprised you by attending CHIRP? Well, the thing that surprised me at first was uh, I did not think CHIRP was going to be like it was. I thought this was going to be a retreat like I've seen before. You know, you go, you pray, you eat, you pray some more, and you reflect and things like that. And it, it wasn't. It was, um, there certainly was more, uh, it was dynamic. There was a lot of uh, discussions amongst uh, the, the people attending. And, and it just, uh, uh, the focus was different. It was, it was on uh, each of us as individuals uh, thinking about our relationship with God and uh, thinking about uh, are we going to, you know, can we renew our relationship with God or do we need to take another look at it at this point in our lives, depending on what whether we were young men, uh, um, some of the men were young, had children, some of the men were older, uh, some of the men uh, had the challenges of uh, adult children. Um, so I, I, I really feel I got a lot of it. I'm looking at yourself before CHIRP and after CHIRP. Mm -hmm. How do you feel CHIRP has changed you, if anything? Well, I think CHIRP has uh, given me an opportunity to try to get more involved with uh, activities of the church. Uh, concurrent with the CHIRP last year, my wife and I, we. Uh, Partake, uh, we participated in the uh, Bible study for the first time uh, that uh, for us as a couple. And then uh, we also um, uh, participated in some of the, the Lenten discussions and things like that. So I think CHIRP kind of uh, was successful in rekindling uh, one of the fires uh, relative to uh, trying to uh, learn more about God and our religion. And uh, to, so again, kind of, I go back to that renewing or recharging the battery um, I, I think that's the that's the key. All right. Thank you, Dave. It's been welcome. Thank you. Oh man, that was good. Can I just?